Wolfies! We have new Wolfies and I want them all, every single variety. But there's one big problem. Once you find a wolf, how do you get it home? Some of them spawn in biomes that are miles away. Will I have to go for some really, really long dog walks? Or are there better ways of getting your new doggy home? Well, yes there are. And in this video, I want to show you four alternative ways to transport dogs over long distances. And the last one is so easy, you won't believe it. Just in case you missed it, this is the new puppy situation. The Minecraft 120.5 update gave us nine gorgeous new wolves and each type spawns in a different biome. So here is a handy chart for you. As you can see, these are all woody biomes, but some of them are really rare and they may be thousands of blocks away. So if you want all the wolves, you need to travel a lot. And we want to make that as easy as possible. To do that, it's really important to understand wolf mechanics. Say you find a wolf, you have successfully given it a few bones and now your new dog loves you. In fact, it loves you so much it tries to follow you wherever you go, unless you make it sit. It even teleports to a nearby free block if you are more than 12 blocks away from it. So you're probably thinking, if dogs teleport to their owners, why is it so hard to get them home? Can I not just strap on my elytra and fly to my base and surely the dog will come and find me? Well, some of you have probably already tried that and found out that it doesn't quite work like that. Unfortunately, there are some things that stop dogs from teleporting. So, the first problem is that only walking dogs can teleport. Teleportation doesn't work if a dog is immobilized in some form. So, if it's sitting, if it's in a boat or in a minecart, or if it's tied up, it can't teleport at all. And if the chunk your dog is in is unloaded, it also can't teleport. The second problem is your dog can only teleport to you if it knows where you are. When you are not touching the ground, it can't find you. So if you're flying, swimming or in a boat, teleportation doesn't work. And if you're in a different dimension to your dog, your dog also can't teleport to you. So if you are in the nether, for instance, and your dog is in the overworld, it can't reach you. And that is why you can't just fly home and wait for your dog to teleport to you. It can't find you while you're flying. And when you reach your faraway home, the chunk that you left your dog in is unloaded. So it's stuck there. And that's, that's, that's not ideal, right? So how do we get around that? Well, if you don't fancy walking thousands of miles, here are some more interesting ways of getting Fido back to base. Method number one, the cheeky one. If you are fortunate and play Minecraft or Java, there is a cheeky alternative that can cut your walking time by a staggering 87.5% because Java players can travel on the nether roof. Simply make your dog sit and write down the coordinates where you are. Then fly back to your base. If you haven't got a portal on the nether roof yet, now is the time to get one. Any distance on the nether roof is only one eighth of the same journey in the overworld. And if you're not sure how to get onto the nether roof, it is actually quite easy. There's a link to a simple tutorial in the video description. So once you're on the roof, take your dog's location and divide the X and Z coordinates both by eight, like this. This is the location on the nether roof where you need to go now. Now build another portal here and hey presto, you're reunited with your doggy. Hello, buddy. All you need to do now is push your sitting dog into the portal. And once you're both on the nether roof, you and Poochie can simply walk back to your home portal together. Method number two, the crazy one. Fly home. Yes, you heard me right, fly with your dog. This one's a bit crazy, a little risky and really, really fun. Put your dog on a lead and use your elytra to get home. Now, you may already know that your lead breaks instantly if you use rockets, but if you gently glide without rockets, you can turn your dog into an airwolf. You can potentially glide for more than 2000 blocks if you start from build height. Maybe use some slow falling potion just in case, because occasionally a lead will break, so this method is not 100% safe, but it's really, really fun. Method number three, the technical solution. 
If you're not afraid of a tiny bit of redstone, this one may be for you. Remember, your doggy can only teleport from a loaded chunk, so I have built a very simple chunk loader here in the forest. Now, if you're a little bit intimidated by redstone like me, and you hear the word chunk loader, you immediately think, oh, this is way too complicated for me. But I looked it up and I was really surprised. It's actually not that difficult. I found a really quick and easy to understand tutorial and I put it in the description too. So theoretically, I can now fly home and this chunk stays loaded, but I need to make sure my doggy stays here until I get back to my base. How do I do that? So here's one way you can do that. Tie up your doggo, but make sure he's not sitting. If I make it sit, it can't teleport, so it has to be standing. Then build a super easy 5 minute timer with a pressure plate. Once the item on the pressure plate despawns, the piston will push the fence post and break the lead. At that point, the dog is free to teleport to me. So now I have 5 minutes to Elytra home, which should be plenty. And when I get home and the time is up, Poochie Woochie will instantly teleport to me. Hello buddy, welcome to your new home! And finally, here's method number 4, the double act. This last solution is by far the simplest and my favorite, but it only works if you have a friend to help you. Invite your friend to go wolf hunting with you. Adventures are always more fun with a buddy. Hi, Blucky! Oh, hi, Dippy. You, How are you? Do you fancy going wolf hunting with me? Oh, yes! Okay, we need to find some black wolves. Okay, okay. Where, where do you find those? Hang on a minute, I'll give you some bones first. Okay, okay, um, so you find them in the old growth pine tiger and we need to go there But the nearest old growth pine tiger is miles away. Hang on. It is 2178 blocks away um, So we can just fly there. It's This way follow me. Okay, we made it. We made it. Let's see if we can find some oh, wolves excellent. We're looking for the black ones are you a zombie? Oh, oh found, you found I, one. I found one. Tame it, tame it, tame it quick. Oh, 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 there's there's another one. There's another one. There's another one. <gasps> oh, I see it. Be my friend. Don't run away. Don't run away. Be my friend. Be my friend. Yes. <gasps> Only two bones. Okay. Whoa. Come on, come on, buddy. And when you have found and tamed your wolf, simply tie it up. Okay, so, okay, so they need to be standing, right? Um, so okay. you need to stay here while I fly back to base and then mm -hmm. when I write in chat untie the wolves, okay? That's when you yeah. untie the wolves, okay? Okay. Okay. I think I can okay. do that. Okay. Okay. Right. Excellent. Okay. I am um, Ofski. See you later. See you later. When you reach your base, tell your friend that they can now untie your dog. Okay. Let's see. Oh, it's done. Oh my god. It just teleported right here. There you go. Hello, buddy. You are a good doggy. Okay. Very nice. Okay. Uh, no, come over here and join the other poochies. Come on. Come on. Good boy. Good boy. Come on. Come over here. You can go into the stable with the other dogs. It's a nice place. <laughs> it's a nice place. Okay. You sit here. You stay here, my friend. Thank you, Blackie. Now you can buy your friend a pizza to say thank you or return the favor and get their dog home. Okay, I'm back. Hello. Oh, hello, DP. Okay. Right. Hello. That was not a soft landing. No, that was not a soft landing. Okay, so do you want me to mind your dog and you fly home now? That would be excellent. Okay, right. Okay, see you later. Bye. Okay, I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Oh, release the hound. Okay, release the hound. Releasing the hound. There you go. Oh, and it disappeared. whoop de whoop Okay, that was... Oh, there he is. Oh, he got it. He got it. Okay, thank you very much. Well, thanks for your help. That was fun. That was great fun. Okay. Thank you very much. I know I've got a dog. Yeah, you have. A black dog okay, for a black shadow. I will see you later. Bye. And that's it. Everyone's a winner. And that was that. Four ways to get your dog home without wearing out your Minecraft boots. Which one are you going to try first? Let me know in the comments. Enjoy your new doggies and have a hippy dippy day. Bye bye.